the news. <laughs> the House of Hopes declares that normal is over. Places, dreams, and destiny in your life yeah. is never for you, yeah. but it's for the lives attached to you. Yeah. Oh, I, I wish I had a witness in here. Yeah. I said it's not for you, but I hope y'all can handle this because because y'all get ready to tear Connie's off up. Listen, the destiny that's on your life, if you don't reach your destination, some family members won't make it. Some co-workers won't make it. You have got to get to the place that God has destined for you to go. I just need somebody who's got a determination that says, I will let nothing separate me from the love of God. Am I talking to you? I need you to give God a crazy praise for about 30 seconds. Come on, open up your mouth. Come on, it's not about you. It's not about you. But I got some cousins and some nieces and some nephews and some aunties and some neighbors that I got to get to my destination. I got to make it. I got their life depends on it. What, what, what do you do when your destiny it's going to cause you to cry at night. What, what do you do if, if the one that God has assigned me to deliver yes. is causing me the most pain? Yeah, y'all didn't hear what I said. Y'all didn't hear what I said. What, what do you do when when Destination is assigned to the one that's getting on your last nerve. What do you do when, when God says, if you want the next level in me, you got to deal with the one that's driving you up a wall? I'm, I'm coming your way in a minute. What, what do you do when your next level, your promotion that you can see in your vision? It's attached to the one that's giving you the most ill. What do you do? Listen, if you're not willing to suffer for it, God is not going to release it into your destiny. I wish I had a witness. Here. If you're not willing to fight for it, God is not going to give it to you. Look at some of this thing that God has got inside of you. You're going to have to be willing to fight for it. Is there any fighters in the house today? Look, look at your neighbor and say, neighbor, don't push me. Because I'm real close to the edge. Is there, if, do you have anything in your life worth fighting for? Would you fight for your kids? Would, would you fight for your marriage? Would you, oh, no, you just going to burn the towel? The devil is like, I will fight. I'll fight if I got to pray all night. If I got to fast. If I got to turn my plate down. I will fight. No weapon form against me. Shall prosper. If I got any fighters in the house, I dare you to give God your best fighting praise right through here. I want you to touch three people and say, fight for it, fight for it, fight for it. Yeah, he's after your daughter, he's, he's after your son, he's after your child, he's, he's after your house, he's after your, your, your ministry, he's after your dream. He wants to steal your destiny, he wants to steal your joy. But is there anybody in the house that I will fight? I'll bless the Lord at all times and, and his praises shall be in my mind. When I think about Jesus and all he's done for me, I will fight! Subscribe to isufa.com, also on the web, at Sufa Group, view, follow, like.